name is Walter Burton, and uh, this is my wife, Beatriz. I'm originally from uh, Missouri, and uh, Beatriz is originally from Mexico City. We both ended up in beautiful BC. That's just uh, been our home now for over 40 years. We met at, we're widow and widower, and we met at the one Sunday morning after Mass at Sacred Heart Church. And uh, I fell uh, madly in love like a teenager. I was so infatuated with her. I still am. <laughs> so uh, anyway, we've now been married for 20 three years going on 24 and uh, we are regular mass attenders in fact we go to mass several times a week and we say the rosary every day and uh, the Lord has helped us to have a wonderful life together Good. about the children now you tell and uh, the present from heaven has been that our children, Walters and mine, they uh, get along very well. They, uh, we hope that they help each other um, to get salvation. That was our desi desire in the wa wedding day, and we openly express it that our union could help all of us to say hi in heaven one day. There's only 11 children between the two of us. So, you know, I mean, it's a real simple proposition. <laughs> I had seven and she had four. And of course, they're scattered around quite a bit all over BC. And uh, one in New Zealand, one in Washington State, and one in Toronto. So, but uh, we do get together every once in a while, and it's really a hoot. What is something special that connects you together for life? I don't know. We love each other. She, we've always loved each other, uh, kind of from the first sight. And uh, we just uh, love each other and we love the Lord. We, we got married with the idea that it was a lifetime union. And uh, that, that we were bonded as one body and one soul. And there just isn't any option. That's the way it is. And, and we're happy with it. So we're very happy with it. How, how about you, Beatrice? Do you have anything to say? I have many things to say. <laughs> you to tell me when I'm talking too much. Well, I would like uh, the people that is so kind to listen to us to know that we, as I come from Mexico, we spend a um, good four months of the year in Manzanillo, which is a port in the Mexican Republic. And there we do some social work. We, uh, it's called the Santiago Foundation. We have two centers in our area and uh, located in parts where there is many people, no privileged uh, individuals, but down to their everyday people. And there they, we impart different courses that could improve their income and, and their well being. Like, for instance, in our centers, we impart a painting, piñata making, um, artistic painting, and. Um, English. English, which is very necessary down there, and uh, uh, also what we call lecto escritura, that is people that they don't know how to write and 
and read, we teach them that. And music, uh, guitar playing and singing and dancing too. Very close to the Mexican culture. Is there anything else that you want to say before uh, we finish? Well, um, I would like to say that our friend, Father Michael, who married us, had been two times visiting, visiting us in Mexico. So it's a good witness that what I'm telling you, it's, it's a fact. And I'm invited inviting you also to come and visit <laughs> oh not everybody at once <laughs> okay, okay. Uh, Beatrice was a generous soul <laughs> um we uh you know, we want to just impart that uh, look for the right person and somebody that uh, loves the lord and and, and uh, you love the lord and um, it's going to work out pretty good. And uh, we wish everybody all happiness. And thank you for listening to us. Mm -hmm.